Welcome to the tutorial for getting started with Noodle Tools. You've probably heard the word plagiarism before. This is when you take words or ideas from someone or somewhere else without giving proper credit for where you found the information. One way to help avoid plagiarism is by making sure you cite your sources. Citing your sources ensures you give credit when needed and allows your teachers to see where your information came from. There are a few styles that we can cite in. But for middle and high school, you will almost always use the MLA style. You don't need to know too much about the ins and outs of citing. Just know this. 1. When using a quote or idea from someone else, you must give credit. 2. MLA style is a way to give credit in the form of a citation. And 3. There are rules to follow for MLA. We will use a tool called Noodle Tools to help cite since it knows all the MLA rules. If you do not have a Noodle Tools account, it is easy to set up. First, go to the Media Center website at newmanslibrary.com and click on the link for the Noodle Tools login page. Bookmark this page for future reference. Always use the right side of the screen to log into Noodle Tools where it says Access via G Suite Office 365. Type your full school email in the box that asks for your Google email. Then, click Sign in with Google and enter your school password. The very first time you use Noodle Tools, you will need to complete a few more simple steps to set up your account. First, select the middle school as your location from the drop down menu and click Continue. Next, leave it set to I am a student or library patron and click Create Account. You are now in your Noodle Tools account. Let's take a look around at some common features of your account. Once you log into your account, you are taken to your projects page in Noodle Tools. This is where all your saved projects live and where you can create new projects when needed. To create a new project, simply click the green button at the top left that says plus new project. Whenever you start any assignment citations in Noodle Tools, begin with a new project to organize your resources. Give your project a title. Choose MLA for your citation style and Starter for your citation level. You may move on to Junior at some point, but Starter is a good place to begin. Then click the blue Submit button. Now notice the tabs at the top of the screen. We were just in the Projects tab. Now we are in that project that we just created and our tab has moved to Dashboard. There are many features on the dashboard you can play around with, but for now, let's click on the Sources tab. This is where any citations you create for this project will stay. To begin a new citation, click the green plus new source button on the top left. You will then need to tell Noodle Tools what type of source you are citing. Clicking on each source type will provide you with more specific source types to choose from. Make the best choice you can because this will determine if your citation is formatted correctly for the source you are using. Once you click on the correct source type, you will be given a template of all the information Noodle Tools needs to correctly cite your source in MLA style. Ask for help if needed. When you are done with the citation, click the green Save button, which is here at the top and also here at the bottom. Once you hit save, Noodle Tools will take all the information you provided on that source and arrange it properly in MLA style. This is called a citation. Your citations live in Noodle Tools until you take them out. Your teachers will not log into Noodle Tools as you to see your citations. You will need to export them into what is called a works cited page. This is simple. Make sure you have cited all the sources you use for your assignment. Then click the print slash export button and choose print slash export to Google Docs. Noodle Tools will create a perfectly formatted MLA style works cited page for you. When the document opens, you should not change it in any way. Leave it as Noodle Tools gave it to you. Then provide this document to your teacher however they've requested it. And that's it. You are now ready to start using Noodle Tools. For help with citing specific source types, please see the Media Center's other videos.